we need to understand and ask ourselves an important question. What results are we looking for? Mm. What results do you want? You can have any results in this life. Think of everything as a spectrum, like a rainbow. You can choose yellow, you can choose green. Because that person chose green, but you really like yellow, doesn't make that person wrong for choosing green. Now, in that same way, you have to ask yourself, do you want health? What level of health do you want? Do you want to live in a city? Do you want to live by the beach? Would you like to play Xbox during the day? Would you like to go swimming? Would you like to live in a cave? Or would you like to sit in the sun? Would you like to fast? Would you like to overeat? It's your decision. Mm. All these factors are your own decision. There's no right or wrong. If playing Xbox, eating chicken burgers, and living in a little um, four-walled house somewhere else in the city is possible, surely there's a reason why it's possible. Think about that. Universe allowed that to exist. You can right now go kill a chicken, barbecue it, put it between two dry pieces of toast, go grab a game station, sit inside a room and do what you want. It's made possible because it's a choice in life. And call it duality or whatever you want. The point I'm trying to make is, is that just because you decide to juice fast, hang out in the equator, get super bronze and reach optimal health, doesn't make anybody else wrong for choosing their path. Some mm. people like to eat lentils and spices and eat cooked food, but they're not looking for your results. So don't, you can't judge them. They don't want your results. You want to be the most sucked up, radiant, glowing version of yourself. They just want to be who they are. And that's not necessarily what they're manifesting and visualizing. Therefore, my point is, on the menu is available to be the most attractive, I'm sorry, but I, I think we should be thin, the thinnest, most radiant, aesthetic, beautiful, glowing version of yourself. And thinnest, not in a way of, like, thinnest, thinnest, no, but not, in not a natural anorexia. way. The natural yeah. thin we want to be. Basically, getting, when I say thinnest, I mean removing all the inflammation or obstructions in the body getting rid of all of that is the thinnest you can be not necessarily your lowest level of body fat it's the cleanest you can become that's the thinnest you can be because generally when the body detoxifies and loses weight it loses dead weight it loses everything that shouldn't be there and when you remove that you can't really see a human body look at a five-year-old or a seven-year-old that's that's a as 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 thin as what I mean as thin is, um, and that doesn't come from under reading. Uh, that's a completely different topic. But the point is, is that we can't judge anyone for what they're doing, whether they decide to eat cooked food or not. It was their choice. They're manifesting it, and they want it. And it's not right or wrong because if it was wrong, why does it exist? It exists. It's all in our reality. We just choose what we want, and life is as simple as that. And you can choose to be healthy today and be sick tomorrow. Again, it's a choice. Every day we're making decisions on so many different levels. So we need to become into alignment and think about what, what, what do we want? What are we visualizing? What are we attracting? And what is the recipe to cause that? Because we live in a universe of cause and effect. What cause will produce the effect I want? What will make me bronze? What will make me full of nutrients? What will make me hydrated? And that comes into our lifestyle because me and Daniel want to be the highest version of ourselves. So we're willing to do what it takes. If that means go get 10 kilos of limes, relocate to the tropics, fast for a while, grab a juicer, that's what we're willing to do because mm. we want those results. Mm. Why? Because we're attracted into being the most vibrant version of ourselves because we're looking for that feeling of vitality and cleanliness and, and, and being as light as we can in mind, body, spirit. We're not interested in going in circles, you know, eating for emotions, contemplating it, trying to fast it out, come back, go up, go down. Have a salad, don't feel good about it. Yeah, overeat, stay at home with your parents, live in a city. So the message is, is that everything's on the menu. You choose what you want just because you chose that doesn't make anybody else better or worse. Just because you chose to be at level five, but we chose the level 10, doesn't make you wrong for level five, and we won't judge you for being at level five. We're saying, just be conscious that you chose level five and you got level five, and don't go complaining at people who have level 10 why they have it and you don't. Because it's your choice to have level 10. And there is cause and effect that goes behind that, so you gotta understand what will cause those things. So the higher up you wanna go, 
the more surrendering you need to do. That's what I'd say.